Iowa and Maryland, Baltimore County, UMBC, Iowa, a massive 26 and a half point favorite in this one. Look at that total, 177 for this one uh, on the week before Christmas. Uh, Jeff Nadu, you're going to have the official play. What is the thought? You've taken some massive lines for favorites before, including with SMU on our show yesterday. I'm curious what your play is here for Iowa UMBC. I like the over. I played over 177 here. I had this at 179. I think it's a game where Iowa will get to 100. I think they'll probably get into the 100s. Um, This is a team that against this type of opponent has done it quite regularly, if we're being honest. They've scored 110 against North Dakota, 98 against Alabama State, and 103 against North Florida. And now they play a team who has the fastest possession length in America. No one has played quicker than UMBC. UMBC is eighth in possessions per game, Iowa 30th. Both these teams are going to have a mound of possessions in this game. And I think there's one thing we've learned about Iowa over the last, I don't know, 20 years. They're always very good on offense. They're going to pick apart a bad UMBC defense, but this is a very average defensive team. In fact, they're not a good defensive team. UMBC is actually pretty decent, and they're going to go downhill. They're going to get to the line, and I know that doesn't really show in their stats, but they're going to get to the line with how they play. They have regularly gotten destroyed defensively on the season. I had this at like 105-79 or something. I I think this is a high-scoring game, Um, and, and again, I'm really not scared off by these totals. I don't care that much. I think Iowa gets into the hundreds, and I think BC will score as well. All right, interesting. Again, we've talked about Iowa, that they have slipped some. They had lost three in a row. Again, quality of competition. They had lost to Purdue, lost to Iowa State on the road in the rivalry game, and then lost to Michigan, giving up 90 points. They bounced back and beat Florida A&M. Corby, any thoughts on what kind of Iowa team we're going to see? And if uh, if Jeff's point here about they're going to be able to carry this thing for a lot of it with their own scoring for the over, any thoughts, Corby? Yeah, the team total is 101, so I expect Iowa to get to the, the hundreds pretty frequently. Um, this is a UMBC team that, that doesn't care to play defense, and they don't really care to not push pace. 83 possessions versus Maryland. Maryland, a team that I've talked about, I absolutely hate their offense. Maryland scored 92 on this team. So Iowa, a better offense than Maryland by a significant margin. Also, we've talked about this on the show a million times. Iowa is a team who, with four minutes left, and they have scored 100, are going to try to score 120. Uh, They will try for those last 20 points. It's just the nature of what they do. So um, feel pretty fine on an over here. Uh, An interesting note, and it'll hit both of Nadu's bets today, is since 20... I, I don't care to talk about these trends a ton. Like, they mean nothing. But I will say, like, once you get to a total so high, like, there's only a, there's only a certain number that the market can go to. They couldn't have made this number 190. Or, like, they would have seen a completely lopsided action slip. So, since 2015, totals over 170 uh, are hitting at a 56% clip to the over, which I, I take no weight to. Uh, but I do think that it's at least notable that, like, I don't think they could have made this number any higher. I feel like they were like, okay, this is the highest we can go um, and, and potentially get some under bets. Uh, I think this is over or nothing. UMBC can't stop a cold and Iowa's here to score. So 110 for Iowa wouldn't surprise me at all. And then can UMBC score like basically 70? Uh, I think that's plenty fine. Here. I think, what we're, I think we're, what we're starting to see here is that, and I'm just going to say it, I don't think bookmakers have any idea where to put the totals right now. I think they're being bombarded. I think they're just throwing stuff out. Sharps are getting destroyed. Look, this money, look, you're always going to see sharp money come in and take an under when it's super high. It hasn't mattered. I mean, they're blowing them out of the water. Um, and this is something where you, when you look at Iowa games, I think you can take a lot of solace in what you saw the year before or, or, or two years before. I mean, in games like this last year, I mean, 112-71, um, 106-75 against these higher tempo teams, I think, I, think, I think they just don't know where to put these numbers and they're just throwing stuff out. Interesting. And again, that's a massive, what, 101 you said for the team total for Iowa, Corby? That's a massive, in a 40-minute game to get to that number. Uh, We shall see. That's why it's handicapping. All right, so Jeff says points. He wants a lot of them. Carver Hawkeye Arena Big Ten Network at 7 local time, 8 Eastern time for this one tonight, Iowa UMBC. Let's go. 